check it out. We finally got the snow to melt. Check out our video where we flew with the floats for water on the snow. It was awesome. Info card right there. We got the beaver, and I was telling you guys in a live stream a while back, uh, you were with me when I mounted these tires up. These are the Dubro air-filled five-inch tires. What's cool about that is I think if they were any bigger, I would have to use uh, some hardware to make this happen. I was able to use the stock hardware with the five-inch Dubros. I'll put links to the uh, in the description so you know exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, I didn't have to get any extra hardware. I was able to use the hardware that came with the kit. The threads are a little short. Some of you guys may want to get a longer one. That's fine. Do it. But it, you know this. You don't have to. I just turned the nylon locking nuts around and put them on that way so I could bite some threads. And it's been holding up out here at the fun park. Let's get it up in the air. But I want to shoot some landings with this thing. This I really love it on the wheels. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Let's do it. All right. field. Winds are funny around here. But this is a bush plane that I thought always deserved a tire treatment. 6S Power, the big FMS Beaver is awesome. A lot of you guys know how truly powerful it is. Uh, it's fun to watch guys really whip this around. But right now I'm just going to try to keep it close and show you I think the benefit of these wheels on a very rough field. Look at that. It gets right over. And then power to get up and out. I just want to keep it on the ground for you. <laughs> and this is some lumpy, bumpy, definitely out of grade terrain. And uh, the gear were always plenty strong. It's just the tires that come with the model are extremely rigid. Ooh, that was butter. Driving around, but there's some poles out there somewhere. <laughs> Yeah, that's nice. We're gonna start from too high with a big slip, still full flaps. We'll see what I get. I was awfully high there from that approach. Dead stick in that. All right, let the rudder clean up a little, juice it, and uh, line it up. Kind of hot, but we're good. <laughs> yeah. Bring it around. Goodness sakes. Bobby, you got to fly this some more. <laughs> this has been a, a blast out here. It's such a good plane. It really is. It, it always deserved this. Yep. And if you're in the north, you can fly this thing all year round. You put the floats on it, it's absolutely great off snow. It is. And water. And it's water. Really good yeah, on water. it is awesome on water, too. Right rudder, a little bit of left aileron, a little throttle. You buddy. Going for a little bit more of a three pointer. I didn't quite get it. That's all right. It's a little, it's a lot bumpier than what it looks. No stabilization in this model either. Yeah, she's plain Jane. Just set up on uh, rates and a little bit of expo. Yep. 60. Definitely, definitely got a down compensation uh, elevator flap. So. Yep. Yeah, and rates I have set at my basic, my usual 60, 80, and 115 percent expo. Full flap. 1122. Oh, nice three. That was perfect. Woo. Oh, nice three. That was perfect. Woo. That was perfect. That was a good one. That was. I, I'm thinking stall, full bleed, just let see what this thing can do on this setup and that was full stick on your rates anyway yeah as slow as i could get it that was a nice one that was perfect we're gonna get it back over here and see how fast we can get it off i know it'll get off a lot shorter than it will land and stop yeah let's lose the flaps for the taxi back now you hear oh look at the lights just dig the gear too i know You can get an idea how bumpy it is out here. I know. Dude, okay, this is a good spot for it. Uh, 
Stall takeoff, let's go flaps. And uh, I'm gonna just stay in this rate. Pretty safe, I don't think I'll like get, in, get off too fast. You ready? Yep. Cranking it. <laughs> 10 feet? Yes, I'd say. Maybe a tick less. I was in it. Yeah. It's a solid plane. It, it looks is. really scaled. This version two with the clear glass um, is fantastic. I have a feeling when you get them uh, at Horizon through the, my link in the description, it may even be offered in a reflex pretty soon if it's not already. Ooh, man, yeah. I think this is just fantastic. Let's lose those flaps. So nice. <laughs> like I said in the flight, this is a great plane. We've got loads of videos on the FMS Beaver uh, back on our video catalog on the channel, uh, but we've never put it up on soft tires. And we knew from our very first flight that this plane was definitely worthy of further treatment. Uh, it's a blast on floats, like Bobby says. We got videos of it on snow, it's really cool. And it's really great on water as well. And then finally, we got the five inch Dubros on here now too. Yeah. Uh, stock hardware, super cheap mod, plane deserves it, looks great with it. And this is so rough out here. So links to all this stuff if you need it in the description. Thanks for using those links. It helps support our endeavors over here at Pilot Ryan and Bobby K. Um, Industries <laughs> from coast to coast. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> Scared the cat. Scared the cat. Ha. See you in the next one. <laughs>